Hey everyone, see this little dude here? I found this guy in my wife's knickknacks. I don't know where it came from. She doesn't know where it came from. We've had it for ages. But uh, I thought it'd be kind of cool to scan him since he's so tiny. A little bit of detail in there. And I thought of the Altoids box since his feet are magnetic. I thought that would be kind of cool. So I just threw the whole thing on the scan plate and started scanning. Here, let's see what I could get. Let's see. 2.79 million faces. Anyway, he's not attached, he's just magnetically stuck on there. But look at the numbers. Man, this texturing mode on the Pop 2 and the Revo scan is just incredible. Of course, I like the, the color, the RGB mode. I like it a lot. It lets me be a little. Uh, Creative and expressive. There's the mesh only. No texture. Looks pretty good. S zoomed in too far. And I did it twice. Sorry. But look at the surface. It's pretty good. Look at that look at that lip. It's pretty well defined. I like that. A little crisp. Got a little blurby there, but that's okay. You can fix that up in post. I would assume. I'm not good enough at post yet to really get in there and try that. I'm just doing simple stuff in post so far until I learn some better things. Look at those hinges. That's nice. The lettering. Hmm. Nice box. Now I'll take that into uh, Handy, st uh, Handy Studio. Take that into Revo Studio and uh, I clipped off all the junk, uh, clipped the bottom, I, I got a little bit crooked but that's all right, doesn't matter, and I uh, filled in the bottom with the flat fill, the fill hole, flat type, did the other operations, decimated it a little bit with the simplify, enhanced it at the mid-range, I just thought I would play around with the other stuff a little bit. I don't like the bounding box or that that uh, gimbal looking thing, whatever it is. There. I think it looks prettier. Anyway, there's the Altoids dude. Little dude on the Altoids box. Thanks for watching. See you next time.